Hi, Cancer. It's Jeffrey. It's red color. This is your reading for um, November 27th through uh, December 4th. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. I offer private readings. I also offer IET, which is a healing modality, which can help you to move energy. Please subscribe to this to my YouTube channel, become a member. Membership is two ninety nine a month. It allows you to watch these videos commercial free. Uh, go visit my website. Okay, enough. Uh, yeah, I could go on and on. So my little message is: um, don't be surprised. Uh, that's what I got. So almost expect a surprise in a way. I know it sounds weird. But I don't know if that's, I don't know which way that goes, but it's sort of like, you know, sometimes we have things worked out in our head. It's like, oh, it's, it's going to be like that, or it's supposed to be like that, or this way it's always was. And it's like, well, now it ain't. It's like, oh, okay. Like a change is coming and it's like, okay. So it seems like be prepared in a way. Or don't be surprised. <laughs> I had to get that out because otherwise, if I have to get. All right. Let's see what's going on. Yeah. I have two fives. So fives are all about change. Fives are all about change. So this is like. It's a change in the way of thinking. Um, it's also, it's it's really about, I'm going my own way. I used to follow you. I, I used to like think the way you thought. I used to like be part of this community in a way. And now it's like, I'm going to just sort of go my own way because, um, you know, it, it doesn't seem like we really accomplish anything. It doesn't seem like, every, it seems like everyone's in chaos and and I'm ready to move forward into the future. I have a new plan for myself. Yeah, and I'm gonna go after it, you know, and, and it's and it's easy and clear and obstacle free. And this card has been kind of like crazy. So if this card is coming up like crazy, I don't think everyone's sitting around in delusion. I think people are realizing what their dreams are, not somebody else's dream. This is like I supported somebody else in their dream, and now it's time for me to support me in mine. You know, I, I don't really know what it is, but I have like now an inkling of where to go and another five, my third five. There's a big shift going on, a big shift. And, you know, like I, I was disappointed. It was chaotic. I used to think this way. And now I don't exactly know where I'm going. It's sort of a mysterious path. Um, somehow I'm informed by the past of it. It's almost like I'm picking up you know, whenever I hear somebody was, is a dancer, um, there's this element of, um, I relate to them because I, I, when I was a kid, I wanted to dance. So it's sort of like there's this, um, this sweet, innocent kind of like, oh, you're a dancer? Oh, wonderful. You know, there's like a space. There's a certain space that I have for dancers because it's almost like, there was, there's part of me, there's part of my soul that relates to it, even though I never really took action on it. It's a little bit like that. And so I feel like maybe there's some memory or understanding of the past that you're going to be able to access in some way that can um, inform you or lead you to your future or lead you toward... Um, planting a new seed toward um, building something new, toward meeting the, the people that uh, love and support you. Enough of the heartache. You're done with the heartache. It's like there's a soul calling going on. There's an old... So, so don't be surprised that there's a memory or like a soul calling from the past that's saying, well, you know, even though, you know, it didn't, like you didn't do it 20 years ago, or 30 years ago, or 10 years ago, it's like, there's no reason you can't enjoy it or take action toward or 
um, support it now. Because I, it's almost like there's a self-healing going on. That's what it feels like. There's a, a self-healing, a self-comforting. That's what I'm feeling. It's it's really, it's nice. It's nice, but I, I feel like it's coming up so that you can like move through it, release it and access what works about it and utilize it in a new way, plant new seeds somehow. That's what I get. Because this card's been coming out, where is it? Like crazy for everybody. And it's also a seven, so have confidence. Yeah, seven, sorry. All right. Um, coming out of the chaos toward a, a brand new day, not following somebody else's lead, following your own light, you know, thinking creatively about the past in order to move forward into the future with your dreams in tow, acknowledging the grief, but planting something in that fertile soil, something from the past that was a gift that you're going to be able to reignite or recapture uh, toward this new sense of self that you're going toward that's more nurturing, that's more balanced, it's more healing. Interesting reading. Blessings. <laughs>